We begin tonight, though, with breaking news. Politico reporting that it has seen a leaked court draft from February that indicates the Supreme Court would overturn the landmark Roe v. Wade case. For the very latest on this, let's go to Amy Hockert in our newsroom now. Amy, this coming just within the past hour. Yeah, Randy and Kelsey, this is being called an unprecedented leak, a document that appears to be a Supreme Court draft was leaked to Politico tonight, and it indicates that the court will rule to overturn Roe v. Wade. Now, the reaction, as you can imagine, is coming in fast and furious. Now, Politico has released what they say is a first draft majority opinion. It was written by Justice Samuel Alito last February, according to Politico. Now, this is not official, this is not final, and we have not independently confirmed this information by the sources we use here at Fox 9. It's also important to note that that drafts in general can just change even dramatically before a decision is final. And a decision in this case is expected sometime in June. The leak though itself here is historic and the fallout from this report will run deep on many levels. If overturned, as this leaked draft indicates, it would be up to states to decide whether to restrict or ban abortion. Now, tonight, Governor Tim Walls is responding to this report. In a tweet, he writes, let me make something abundantly clear for all Minnesotans. If this reported draft SCOTUS opinion is released, there will never be an abortion ban under my watch. The right to an abortion will be respected in Minnesota as long as I'm in office. Again, the reaction from this leaked draft is pouring in. It's a bit like a fire hose here in the newsroom. We're going to keep working on this story. We're going to bring you the very latest as the night goes on. Randy. All right, Amy, thank you.